Hi guys, so I thought I'd do a quick power test for you today. This one's going to be on the BF UV B2 Plus, which is the latest reincarnation from um, Bofeng. I'll be using the GY561 frequency and power meter, which is pretty accurate to be fair. Um, the battery on this uh, on this radio is fully charged. I charged it yesterday. Um, so it's fully charged and I'll be testing VHF low and VHF high and UHF low and UHF high. So basically that'd be 145500 on VHF and 433500 on um, on UHF it's the calling frequencies. So I'll uh, I'll plug the power meter in now and I'll uh, I'll show you the power test. Okay, so I've got the <clears throat> I've got the radio plugged into the power meter here and uh, we're on VHF low. So if I key up So it's got an auto off function on this uh, on this meter. 2.4 watts. So it's 2.4 watts on VHF low. UHF low. 1.9 watts. VHF high. 6.1 watts. And UHF high is 5 watts. Hey guys, so I hope you found that interesting, I hope it helped. A lot of people have been asking for these videos and um, especially when they're looking at which Bofeng radio to buy. Um, just be aware that the, the power power on these radios um, varies from, from unit to unit. Um, you know, you could buy two of these radios and they could have different power power readings, which I have had with some of my radios as well. So, uh, so yeah. The frequency and power meter they use is pretty accurate, so it just gives you an idea of, uh, of what sort of power these these radios are giving out. It's quite surprised there that the uh, the VHF on high power is six point something watts. Um, it's only advertised at four, so that's that's quite good. So uh, so yeah, if you've got any other ideas for any radios you want power testing, if I've got the radio, I'll uh, I'll by all means throw up a power test video for you. That's not a problem. It's just give me a comment in the box below. Thanks for watching. Seven three for now.